how to cut a grapefruit. When choosing a knife for a grapefruit, you want to look at the size of the grapefruit. Some are smaller, some are larger. When they're in season, they can actually be about this big around. And remember, you always want a, a knife with a jagged edge because you're going to be slicing it. And you want your knife to be a little bit longer than the grapefruit that you're cutting. So um, today we have like a smaller or, you know, small medium sized grapefruit. And <clears throat> we're going to use a utility size knife. You could also use a small carving knife for it as well. What you want to do is you want to look at where are the stems of the grapefruit. So here and here. And you want to cut in between those two stems. So, and you just use a nice slicing motion all the way down through. When I was young, my parents and I, we used to sit around the table with a spoon and we'd sit there and do this and do this and like try to get all the grapefruit slices out. And I just remember it was always hard to do with a spoon that was dull. So um, the next thing you wanna do after you cut it in half is just take your sharp knife and stay in between all of the little skin sections and just uh, cut around all of uh, the grapefruit meat, but stay inside each little section of skin because there's always a little membrane in between each section and you don't want to eat that because it's really bitter. Um, so you just want to get the fruit part out of it. What's cool is it loosens it, loosens it up so when you go in with your, with your spoon to pull it out, it makes it really easy to get it out of there. So just a couple extra seconds in, uh, in preparing your grapefruit for breakfast or lunch or whenever you're eating it can make a big difference in how long it takes you to actually eat it. Now that you've cut around all of your sections, grab a small teaspoon and then you just go in. You can scoop it right out. Now you've got grapefruit to enjoy.